Geeks, what is going on? Unite the Clans here, back in your life, and I'm back in your life today with Caffeine. Now, this is the demo for a upcoming, I think it's described as psychological horror environmental puzzle game. Oh, I did, there we go. Okay, uh, so guys, this, this is it, this is Caffeine. Uh, this, I didn't say anything about the history of the game, but we're in a space station. It's a little alien isolation-esque. And um, we live, this is a, an apocalyptic world where human beings are completely addicted to caffeine. Uh, I don't know if we've woken up without it. Maybe like, or we're realizing for the first time what the world is without coffee. Who knows? But we shall find out. Now, there are post-it notes everywhere. And can I turn you off? No, that's Zoom. Okay. Please fix it. It's driving me insane. Me too, brother. Me too. I don't know if this stuff is important. Uh, I think this is just $20.99. That might be important. It's got a lot of names. There's a, what, a John, a Sarah, I think that must be, a Laura. I can't imagine all this is important. This can't be the sort of puzzle that I'm supposed to be solving. Is that a John with an O, without an H? Yep, there are some two Johns. Look how confusing this is already. Okay, and then this says, these must be important. Will, oh, sorry. You don't have to get that close to the post-it note. So, it says, will do uh, when John, when Sarah, S-E-R-A, so there's two Sarahs, two Johns? Can you please check samples three to nine today? Thanks, love Sarah. And he said yes. What, why am I spending so much time in this room? Open the up. Oh, I forgot that this is a scary game. I was just looking for puzzle and mystery. Flashlight? Oh, it's a broken flashlight. Oh, it works, okay. I don't think. That's a big empty room. Although I'll tell you what, that chair is abnormally sized in comparison to me if I'm a man. I don't know if I'm a human. I mean, look at the door. It's triple my fricked up height. Okay. Oh, look, post it. I need it now. Coffee? What the hell is this place? Oh, I'm getting freaked out already. Who the hell stole all the sheets? Whoever did ain't getting any coffee this month, Anto. So there's an F, oh, my flashlight went out. There's a, oh, I'm creeped out. This is ambient, this is freaky. Don't close that door behind me, you mother effa. Okay, that's it, there's nothing here. Except a creepy dripping noise. Where are all the sheets, good lord? All right, and so what's up here? Did I look in here? No, that's all blocked off. It cannot be worth my time, can it? Am I supposed to knock all these stop making creepy noises? Get out of my way. Like, maybe they're saying, oh yeah, this part of the game isn't finished, so why don't you just F off instead of... Why did I... You better have an important password. Coffee is the key. Key is another word for password. Which way am I going? This way? I'm a true idiot. Okay, yes, we have not been here. Oh, good lord. Yeah, I'm not going in there. There's not even anything in there, is there? No, waste of my time. It's just creeping me out, and they're gonna play freaky music again. Are there really four ways to go? Don't be freaking anything creepy down this mother effing hallway. Seriously, get effed. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. I don't play these kind of games. Thank you. So let's go this way. Or does this not work either? Okay, my bad. Uh, I, I'll say this to you guys. I really try not to swear on the channel. This room isn't so bad. Oh, it's actually sort of soothing. Uh, but in games like this, if they're gonna have some crazy alien come jump out the screen at me, I'm going to say every word that comes to my mind. Multiple ways to go. Okay, that one freaks me out. This one clearly goes towards the... Whoa! What in the hell? This can't be natural, right? No, why would you have shelves in a room that's on a slope like this? This, this is freaking me out, guys. Okay, so that's freaky. There's this way to go, right? Yeah. 
let's do it. Guys, I really don't know where this is headed. If this is, you know, a puzzle that you solve in this game, or whether the point of this demo is really to scare the hell out of you. Offices. What the hell was that? Okay, offices and storage. Oh good, storage is all underwater. Can't wait till the lights go out on me in here. Oh freaky guys, I'm gonna make it brighter for you. I, I, I'm so turned around, I don't know which one I... What is that freaky noise? F off! Oh cool. There is something so freaky about being alone in space. Because no one can hear you scream every <laughs> curse word you know in your microphone. So we're on the perimeter. We're on the perimeter of the ship. But what is the point of all this? Whoa. Something just whispered at me, guys. I swear to God, I do not play scary games for a reason. I'll brighten this up for you guys. But just be aware that I can see shit all when it is that dark. Office 5C. Open! Oh guys, I know it's coming. I know there's a scare coming. It's building so much tension. It's probably through here. Yeah, it probably is through there. So let's just... That is empty. That room is mother effing empty and I'm not even gonna f, f, f around with it, okay? Guess that is a secret passageway. Okay, another empty room, right? You just seriously closed this door on me? Oh, thank God. If I had to relive this freakiness, he sees you. Oh, guys, I'm so scared. Audio log one, November 15, 2097. Dr. Sarah Anderson. Nobody seems to be taking any interest in my findings, so I've decided to record some audio logs to help document my research. Late last night, I started to notice something worrying about some of the samples we have been receiving from tank 2B below on level 7. While observing through a microscope, I noticed a strange mutation, but the test so far has been inconclusive. Unfortunately, I've also lost one of my interns, John, who is currently in an induced coma. I've been told he tripped and hit his head, but who knows. I haven't been sleeping properly lately. It seems like coffee is the only thing that is helping me continue my research. Coffee. It's ironic, I know, working at a caffeine mining station and all. But maybe it's just the stress of everything going on. <laughs> anyway, so that's all I have to think of for today. Till tomorrow. Oh, that was creepy. So something freaky is going on with S. Anderson, who I think might be Sarah, who I think we might live with or room with. So I think, guys, I think I have to go to, into this. I think it's like an access hatch. It seems to be the end of this hall, and do not put the lights out on me right now, mother. Where are we? Where's my flashlight, and where am I? Oh, guys, this is a fuck. It's a maze! What? Am I just back? Is this the kitchen? Where, where do you lead? Oh, were you here the whole time? Yeah, you were. So that's storage. And what was the other thing? Did I not go in the other thing? Offices. Okay, so I'm just looping around on myself? Where the hell am I supposed to go? Oh, there was something on the other side of storage. That's what it is. Just keep your eyes straight ahead and do not freak out. Do not freak out. You are a man and this is a stupid video game. And video games are not scary. Storage. Okay. Guys, I'm, I'm a little lost. I'm going to come back with you when I have gotten myself unlost. The shadows are really creepy, guys. I missed something. Oh, the office with the pylons. I forgot about that. Okay, remember there was that office? Guys, the shadows are really, like, they dissolve, like... Bad photo effects. Is this the one? No, this one wouldn't open. 5C. It's this one. That I apparently have to walk. No! 
That is not a jump scare. Where the hell are we? Okay, 5C. 5C, oh, that's the exact same number, even though we fell below. So this 5C, this is the one we fell into. So we're directly under one of the other offices, which I'm sure is bad for us. So that is just a pool of water. Freak, freaky as it may be. Oh God. Guys, I am gonna scream like a little girl. Oh yes, like a child, like a frightened child is the noises that will be coming out of my face. And again, a creepy green room. Do I have legs? No, I don't have legs. I thought I saw my own shadow. It must be like just those weird divots. Good lord, I'm freaking out over my sh- I don't even have a shadow. I'm freaking out over sh nonsense. So this is a dead end, so I must have to go back through that water. Uh, like out to the right here. Unless I check this, right? Yes, I did. Oh god. I'm expecting terror behind- so down the end of that hallway, because this one didn't open. Stop making freaky noises on me. I'm gonna shit my pants. Okay. Here's where it gets freaky, I'm sure. And what is this? Okay, well, let's avoid that. That's caffeine, please. Will you f, f off with that noise? Good lord. And what is this? This is ominous. Oh, I have to go underwater. Listen to that. How creepy a noise they make. It sounds like a little creepy thing splattering across the surface of the water. Okay, well, I obviously then have to go down maintenance access text. Shaft. Hatch. Right, flashlight ready. Is it water? No, it's not water. Oh, God. Guys, I am... I... This is a long demo. Good Lord. I don't play games like this, so I forget how scary they can be. Now where the hell are we? He won't open. Why won't he open? Is this a door? No, it's not a door. So we'll just have to keep turning right, and eventually we will come to the terrifying thing that is waiting to make me curse and poop. Come on. Okay. So. Keep going right. That's a creepy light. It's a creepy light. Is that a window? No. And it's a dead end. Why won't he open? Why won't he open? The answer is obviously this way, guys. There's literally only one hallway left to scare my brains out. And it's straight ahead here. So um, if you're cool, I'm going to wait for the flashlight to charge back up. There we go. And please don't do anything to me. Oh, that is another dead end. What the hell? I can't have missed anything. I feel pretty confident. This is when they get you, when you let your guard down. This is the end of it. So this is where we fell through, and I went through all these offices. I swear to God, I did. I tried this, right? And I tried you. Well, let's check these one more time, and we will... S is that my shadow? What the hell? Ah! Wow. Okay, cool. Yeah, for how, how... That's a really good looking game. Gave you this intense feeling of actually being alone on a space station, which is scary as hell. Uh, super ambient. I thought it was building me up to some sort of chase or some sort of, you know, it is just a demo, but I thought the scare at the end was a little bit cheap, but I mean, it worked. It scared the hell out of me. I thought that was my own shadow, which I had just joked about, wouldn't it be funny if I got scared by my own shadow? That is it, geeks. Thank you for watching my playthrough of the demo of Caffeine. If you like this game and you'd be interested in seeing me play more of it, let me know. Uh, and until next time, geeks, I will see all of you in my next video.